have answered me from my household. You have answered me from my prayer. And I come in agreement with the people of God in this house for their parents. Uh, for their family member, for their loved one. Uh, you said in your word, dear God, uh, for you so love this world that you have given your son Jesus Christ, uh, that whosoever believe in him shall not perish, uh, but have an everlasting life. Uh, and this morning, dear God, uh, we do not want our loved one to perish uh, and go to a lost eternity. Uh, but we come believing you. You said in your word, any two shall agree in touching anything it shall be done uh, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth uh, and so Father we are more than two and three that gather here uh, in your presence believing you God uh, for the God for the salvation uh, of our loved ones save them uh, heal them deliver them bring them out of darkness uh, into marvelous light we give you honor we give you praise uh, in Jesus mighty name and our God's people shout amen I want you to declare it. I know that my family members are saved. I know my family members have come out of darkness into God's marvelous light. Hallelujah. I plead the blood of Jesus over every household this morning. I plead the blood of Jesus. I come against every spirit of alcoholism. I come against every spirit of drugs. I come against every spirit of theft. I come against every spirit of violence. I come against every spirit of murder. I come against every spirit of confusion. And everything that is not of God that stands itself against the children of God and their children and their loved one. I bind it right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. While you're standing, I want you to turn to your Bible to first Testimonials chapter 5 and verse 6. Hallelujah. Can somebody praise him? I just felt such an awesome anointing. I believe that God was so much into that prayer. I really believe that God was so much into that prayer. I want to prompt you saying, I don't know who. Uh, come on, there's some mothers. You've been cry crying out for your children. Uh, go have a blessed year. God save them. I said in the realm of the spirit, God just save your child. God just deliver your child. Probably your children are in trouble. God is bringing them out. I don't care if they're in prison. God is going to bring them out of prison. If they're a drunkard, God... Come on, I'm agreeing with you. Receive your miracle for your children this morning. I can feel it in my spirit. Receive your miracle. Here comes your miracle. Father, I pray for those children. You see these mothers, these praying mothers. Save them, deliver them, and make them preachers for your gospel's sake, Father. Somebody just rejoice, rejoice. My God, we're going to have a little anointed service this morning. Woo! Hallelujah! The devil ain't going to touch your children. I prophesy it over your life. I said no devil ain't going to touch your children. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If you have your children standing next to you, lay hand on their belly and say, I now call you forth a preacher in Jesus' name. Do it, moms. Do it, dads. Hallelujah. I'm telling you, I felt in my spirit. Allow me to prophesy today. I feel very prophetic. But I declare that God is about to raise up a, a generation of great preachers from the tabernacle. And God is going to use some of your children. You have been coming to church year after year. But this year I prophesy that your children are going to start getting involved in ministry. I said your children are coming forth. I'm not going to allow that devil to mess with your family. Do you hear me here today? No. Somebody say my child shall come forth with the anointing greater I'm telling you, I'm prophesying, uh, some of your sons and your daughters are going to do deliverance even in a greater anointing than which I am standing right now. Hallelujah. I'm telling you, I already felt it. I uh, feel it. Uh, God is about to raise some great pe preachers uh, out of your children, out of your household that will stand behind these pulpits. Uh, I'm telling you, I'm going to find mighty men and women of God uh, right here in this house. I 
healing. Come on, let's pray for your children. Pray for your children. Pray for your children. God, raise up some musicians. Raise up some choir members. Raise up some Sunday school teachers. Raise up some he some people that are going to believe in healing and deliverance. Raise up their God some mighty preachers. Raise up some mighty deliverers. Raise up some mighty evangelists. I believe that God is in pursuit of some great men and women of God. God is looking for some humility. God is looking for some people that are ready to humble. Come on, Peter, and say, Father, I give you, I give my child over to you. Dedicate them into the hands of God this morning. Give them over to God. Say, Lord, I pray that you bring my child in and use them. Use my child in this ministry, God. Use them, Lord. I pray that the hands of the devil will never be upon them, but use them. Hallelujah. I'm here to tell you, some of you are going to be so proud of your children, what God is going about to do in their life. I pray that God activate their talents. I pray that God activate their ministries. And I pray that God bring them out of darkness into His marvelous light.